Hi, we're with Ed Kiswitter today, who is the keynote speaker for the Employee Engagement Awards Africa for the 2019 conference. And uh, Ed, thanks for joining us today. And uh, the title of your keynote is Value, Ethics, and Leadership. And um, I'd like for you to be able to talk to our audience today about um, what do you intend to be your main point of view for your uh, keynote today? Well, I mean, I think, first of all, we have to acknowledge that we're in a leadership crisis. Mm. Not just in South Africa, by the way. Globally, we find at a political level, um, at civil society level, at business level, uh, there appear to be a huge leadership void. Mm. And my sense about that is somehow we have lost the essence of what it means to lead, uh, which is ultimately about serving. Uh, and I might clarify, not self-serving, but serving ah. others and serving of a higher cause. And so from a leadership perspective, I believe that leaders must take their work seriously instead of taking themselves seriously. Hmm. Um, and to, to regard leadership as an inordinate privilege um, and never approach it with a sense of entitlement. And so given that background of, or background of leadership deficiency, um, a strong encouragement must be for le those who are privileged to lead uh, to think more about what impact their leadership work will have uh, than what benefits they might derive from it. Uh, because very often um, it's those short-term benefits, it's those um, pursuit of narrow self-interests that destroys the higher purpose orientation that leadership ought uh, to serve. And if you could condense that down even more, uh, the sense that I get out of you is that you're a believer in servant leadership. It's about those that are giving back more than just for yourself at the end of the day. Sure. Um, and, and I call it stewardship. Stewardship. Great and, word. And I like the concept of stewardship because a steward mindset is characterized uh, in a number of very specific ways. Firstly, um, a steward um, understands that he or she holds in trust that which belongs to another and not their own. Fantastic. Uh, secondly, a steward mindset is about serving the bigger cause um, rather than one's narrow self-interest. Um, Jim Collins would call it having a, an ambition, mm -hmm. but not for oneself, yeah. for a cause. Uh, Nelson Mandela and many others demonstrated that wonderful servant and steward leadership. Uh, thirdly, um, I believe that even though they understand that what they have the privilege to lead and to, to, to have stewardship over is not their own, they care for it as if it is. Yeah. And then yeah. lastly, for me, stewards, uh, steward leadership is characterized by this intense desire to bequeath something more valuable than that which you've inherited. That is amazing. I love that last part. And Ed, thank you for introducing all of us to the, you know, there's a, there's a, a little bit of a fine difference between servant leadership and steward leadership. And I think that was some fantastic points that you brought to us today. So thank you.